Hey guys, what's going on? Today in this video, I'm going to show you real quick how to add the new Covenant add-on. Uh, it's going to be replacing Exodus. Exodus is no longer uh, going to be updated or anything like that. Uh, so what you want to do is go ahead and open up your uh, Schism all in one build on your Cody. Uh, once you get it opened up and it's fully loaded, just keep scrolling over until you have the Settings tab highlighted. Just highlight and click it. Then you want to go to Add-ons, highlight and click it. Then go down to Install from Zip File. Once you highlight and click it, you want to look for the Demetrology folder. Uh, either on your build it's going to say dot Demetrology or it's going to say somewhere down here Demetrology without the dot. Once you find it, just highlight and click it. Once it brings you here, you want to keep scrolling down until you see the repository dot Twilight add-on. So as you can see, right here it is. It says repository.twilight-1.1.2.zip. Uh, Once you find it, just highlight and click it. It's going to bring you back here, and then at the bottom right-hand corner, it's going to let you know when the repository was installed. Once you see this message, just go up to install from repository. Look for the Twilight add-on repository. Once you find it, just highlight and click it. Then you want to go down to video add-ons. Click it. Uh, you will, uh, once you open up the video add-ons, you're going to see where it says Covenant. I already have it installed on my build, but what you'll do is just highlight Covenant, click it, <clears throat> and where it says uninstall on mine, it's going to say install. So what you'll do is just install it, click install. Once you do that, it's going to bring you back here, and then it's going to say at the bottom right-hand corner that the add-on was installed. Once it tells you that, uh, what we need to do now is add it to your uh, main page of your Schism All-in-One build. So what you want to do is just highlight Settings again and click it. Then go to Add-ons. And then go to, no, you don't want to go to Add-ons. You want to go down to Interface. Uh, it's going to have Skin highlighted. Just click over to the right and then go to Configure Skin. Then you want to highlight Main Menu Options and then click over to the right and highlight Choose Which Items to Display on the Main Menu. Just click it. Uh, and then what you want to do, uh, the easiest way to do it, uh, you can change your TV shows and uh, movies tab. I already changed my movies tab to Covenant. But what you'll do is just highlight, uh, this will say movies instead of Covenant like it does on mine. What you'll do is just highlight the movies. Then click over choose item for menu. Uh, click it. It's going to bring this up. Just click add on. Then go down to video add on. Look for the Covenant, click it. It's going to bring this up. Just click uh, Create Menu Item to here. It'll replace the Movie tab with uh, Covenant now. Now you want to change your TV Shows tab uh, to Covenant. So what you'll do is just highlight TV Shows. Go over to Choose Item for Menu. Click it. Click Add On. Then go down to Video Add On. Look for the Covenant Add On. Highlight and click it. Again, it's going to bring this box up. Just uh, click Create Menu Item to here. And as you can see, it just switched the Covenant uh, for that. Uh, once you do that, just keep hitting your back button until it brings you back here. It's going to say up at the top, uh, Building uh, Menu. Uh, but now, as you can see, you have Covenant on both tabs now instead of Movies or TV Shows. And again, your other add-ons uh, like Asylum, Stream Hub, Bob, and all that is underneath. You just have to click down. But yeah, that's uh, that's it. Again, it's identical uh, to Exodus. What you'll do is highlight and click it. And I'll just show you guys that it is working perfectly. So what you'll do is click, say click on most popular for TV shows. Uh, you'll click, say you want to watch Orange is the New Black. You'll just click on a season. Click on an episode. Uh, also, I'm going to have you guys adjust the settings uh, in here so you can turn down the provider timeouts as well as turn off the hosters with captchas. But as you can see, it's pulling sources for everything. Uh, it's pulling a lot more HD sources for your TV shows. It's pulling uh, great sources for movies as well. But you'll just click on one. And there's your TV show.
So again, you shouldn't have any issues with this new covenant. Uh, I think it's going to be working like Exodus used to before tvaddons.ag took over. Uh, but now you need to change the provider timeout and the uh, turn off the hosters with captures. So what you need to do is just highlight settings, click it, then go to add-ons, then my add-ons, and then you need to look for video add-ons. Just highlight and click it. Uh, look for the covenant add-on. Highlight and click it, then click configure. Uh, it's going to have the general tab highlighted. What you need to do is change your provider timeout from 30 down to 20. And then go up to the playback uh, tab. Go down with hosters with captchas. It's going to have a dot at the end of that. Just highlight, click it. It'll take that dot away. Once it does, just go down to the bottom and click OK. Uh, but yeah, that's basically it. Uh, you, now you can go back to enjoying all your movies and TV shows. Uh, you will now have this add-on which is covenant you'll have asylum and also stream hub to use for your movies and tv shows thanks